BBC News has explained how internal stories are reported following an unnamed male BBC presenter being suspended. The unidentified man has been suspended amid allegations an unnamed BBC presenter paid a teenager for sexually explicit images. Director General of the BBC Tim Davey has reiterated the state broadcaster is taking the allegations incredibly seriously, as Piers Morgan takes a swipe at the BBC over its coverage regarding the matter. Following the Mail presenter's suspension being announced today, BBC News has shared an insight into how they navigate and report on stories about BBC employees and internal matters. With stories like this one, BBC News journalists treat the BBC in the same way as any other organization the news service reports on, the BBC writes within their report on the suspension. And like with any other organization, BBC News has to ask BBC management or BBC services for responses and contact the BBC press office for official statements. Occasionally BBC journalists approach senior managers for unplanned interviews, known as doorsteps in the news business. It adds, they also sometimes also get offered interviews with management, like this one with BBC Director General Tim Davey over the Gary Lineker row. And when this happens, they know they'll be scrutinized within and outside the BBC over how well they hold their boss to account. Earlier today, former Good Morning Britain anchor Piers Morgan slammed the BBC for previous coverage of the allegations attached the unnamed presenter. Ridiculous, Piers told his followers as he quote tweeted another Twitter user saying, BBC host tasks BBC reporter standing outside the BBC about allegations against unnamed BBC star. BBC reporter says they haven't been able to confirm whether the BBC presenter has been suspended by the BBC. Reports first emerged on Friday that an unidentified BBC presenter allegedly paid a teenager more than £35,000 for sexually explicit pictures. The Sun claimed an unnamed star at the National Broadcaster has been accused of handing over cash sums in return for explicit images from the teenager when they were 17 years old. The mother of the alleged recipient claimed her child used the money to fund an addiction to crack cocaine and she blamed the presenter for destroying her child's life. It is thought the woman's child is now 20 years old. In an additional report, the mother of the anonymous accuser alleged the still then unnamed BBC presenter stripped to his underwear during a video call with her then teenage child. The BBC this afternoon confirmed a male presenter has been suspended amid the allegations, saying in a statement, the BBC takes any allegations seriously and we have robust internal processes in place to proactively deal with such allegations. This is a complex and fast-moving set of circumstances and the BBC is working as quickly as possible to establish the facts in order to properly inform appropriate next steps. It is important that these matters are handled fairly and with care. We have been clear that if, at any point, new information comes to light or is provided to us, this will be acted upon appropriately and actively followed up. The BBC first became aware of a complaint in May. New allegations were put to us on Thursday of a different nature and in addition to our own inquiries, we have also been in touch with external authorities, in line with our protocols. We can also confirm a male member of staff has been suspended. We expect to be in a position to provide a further update in the coming days as the process continues. The BBC board will continue to be kept up to date.